is a great story. A summer staple in western Minnesota is now open for its 104th consecutive season. For more than a century, a popcorn stand in Granite Falls has brought smiles to the faces of its customers. And tonight's Maury Stories, Maury Glover shows us why the people, as well as the popcorn, make that stand so special. The location, the people, just fantastic here. For decades, Granite Falls was known for the power plant just down the Minnesota River that produced electricity for the western part of the state. Since I've been little, I mean, it's been here as long as I've been alive. <laughs> but when summer rolls around... Here we go. Go team. Nothing in town generates more excitement... Oh, hello. How are you this evening? Hey, how are you? Good. We've got hot buttered popcorn. ...than the opening of the popcorn stand at the corner of 7th Avenue and Prentice Street. It's super fresh and the people are always super friendly and nice for the season okay large tub this is the best popcorn there is if you haven't tried it you're missing a treat hey we get our share of anxiety going here when that time of the year rolls around the stand has been popping for more than a hundred years it's a new season so from may day to labor day yes. for a couple of hours every night Volunteers from the local Kiwanis Club serve up tub after tub of hot buttered popcorn. Give customers a seasonal snack. Tell you what, I think if I sit that out, we got Dad some extra hands. It. Dad can okay, help you. Got it, Liam? Be okay. careful, buddy. Well, the opening day of the popcorn stand in Granite Falls is almost like a national holiday. So we literally have had people line up down the block here three quarters of the way down and yeah it's it's just amazing the stand itself is quite small only 30 square feet well thank you very much we'll see you next time we affectionately refer to it as a one butt popcorn stand but it has an oversized impact on the entire community <laughs> thank you have a great evening it's just an icon this popcorn stand is an icon not only in granite falls but most of southwest minnesota the popcorn stand exploded onto the scene in 1919 after brothers Fred and Julius Ernston, who owned a business transporting train passengers to the hotels downtown, had a kernel of an idea to contribute to the Granite Falls annual summer festival with a mobile popcorn cart. The brothers built the first permanent structure in the late 20s, which lasted until 1969, when Fred's son Burnett constructed the current building which was remodeled to look like a box of popcorn in the early 2000s. We believe it was some local contractors that built it, but we don't know who came up with the idea to make it look like a box of popcorn. Now the familiar fixture is a hot spot on Main Street to make new memories or relive old ones. This is a meeting place where people just get together and they visit about the weather local events, what's going on in our city. And for the people who live here to get their fill of the tasty treat. Um, I actually like it just plain. It's, it's so good just the way it is. I don't even get any butter on it. It doesn't need it. <laughs> we'll get people from all over the place. We have people that live in Iowa and South Dakota that'll head to their lake cabin in northern Minnesota on a Friday night and they'll make a special trip through here. Almost since the beginning, any popcorn left over at the end of the night is used to feed the ducks in the nearby river. We used to feed the ducks across the river there and with my parents, a lot of good memories with that. Or the dogs, as the case may be. We have the fattest sparrows here in Granite Falls. And whether butter or nostalgia is the essential ingredient, the two with butter. customers hope their local landmark keeps on popping for another century. <laughs> I won't be here. We, none of us will be here, but <laughs> yeah, let's hope it continues. So I hope the legacy will live on. For Maury Stories, Maury Glover, Box Now. Who isn't hungry for popcorn right now? I know. I <laughs> wish we had wow. popcorn, especially as we get ready to talk about baseball. But, I mean, that picture at night with the yellow light is just magical. There's yeah. something about that kind of popcorn that's popped like that and the real butter, and it's yeah. just so delicious. Uh, I'm so glad that it's still there, and, yeah. I mean, there's mm. popcorn will always be popular. Well, I